Just what does the future hold for us as far as being a buyer or a seller in real estate? Well, as you've heard all the horror stories about the sky is falling, it's not falling. And we do know that the future for the real estate market is still pretty bright. Uh, there'll be a lot, there'll still be a housing shortage, unfortunately, which causes prices to, again, continually raise up, rise up just slightly. We're not expecting near the uh, the up appreciation that has happened in the past. However, we expect this next year to be maybe 5% compared to the old 10% that we've been experiencing throughout. So the future looks quite bright. So what does that mean for you? Well, we know that this is the December season and January is just around the corner. And so what do you suppose that most people do in January? They start thinking about their yearly plan and what they want to do as far as their entire world, including real estate. Well, when they start setting goals, it's always good to be prepared and also be ready to go when you want to pull the trigger, as, as they say. In other words, if you're thinking of selling, say, in April or May, then maybe after the Christmas tree is down, you start thinking about fixing things up around your house so you don't have it to do all at once. So that's the, kind of the scenario that I want to uh, talk to you about. If you're thinking about doing buying a home, then certainly talk to your lenders ahead of time and have all that out of the way so you're ready to go when the time comes. On a different note, as I'm wearing the Santa hat, you know that it is the Christmas season and things are uh, bright and cheery and all that great stuff. However, as you also know, many people um, around Thanksgiving and Christmas, this is not such a joyous time for lots of reasons, family breakups, uh, loss of family members, lots of things that are happening. My only little spiel here is to Think about those people and make their world a little brighter if you can. For example, around Christmas time, if you were to bring a, an extra plate of, of food over to the nice lady down the street that has nobody, uh, just to show appreciation, that's really a special thing to do. The also, it's a good training time for, your, for kids or grandchildren. If you're going to do something to uh, make somebody else's world brighter, have those children or grandchildren part of it because that's a great learning device. Okay, so the real estate world looks bright and Christmas is coming up soon. So until next time, you take care. And again, if you have any real estate questions, just give me a holler at 541. 554-5825. And again, Gary Ray's Remax Integrity. Take care.